space. Said. Reconnection is successful. Ah, is successful? Is the reconnection successful? Have we reconnected to the server? Are we alive and well? Ping. Ping. Welcome back. Welcome back. Do we do 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 do. What an epic, chilling into the video earlier. What a punch in the dark. You know what I mean? You know what I mean, right? What a punch in the dork. Welcome back. Scooby doo 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 doo. My apologies. Alright, I'm just gonna go with it. You guys will reconnect. What a joke, though, huh? What an absolute ridiculous thing. If you ask me. It's just silly. I think we can watch these fools. be in here though and watch him come up here because this will be the best view of everything sorry about the uh, stream earlier if you're back welcome back that's what happens when you live in the middle of nowhere that's my guess Three minutes. Three, two minutes. Two minutes. The moon is dark and here we go. Let's go to town, don't you know, don't you know. Uh, uh, cinnamon, Bobby. Anyone? Bye. Bye. Hey. Hey. It's like a automaton. Oh, I almost didn't make it. No, don't beat on that. Feet on that because that's instant. Oh, buddy, how'd you get in here? we gonna use a fucking pistol because why not? We got one of these. Oh, oh, he had a bullet, son. All right, so we gotta use some bullets. That's good to know. Bye. Bye. Alright, we're still 
still good. Oh, we're getting all kinds of XP. paused it a little bit. I waited. It just, I don't know what the hell. To be quite honest. I don't know what the hell's going on with my internet sometimes. This is like robot heaven though. That Godzilla out there? out here turn it to shoot it shotgun trap uh, you guys gotta make it up here guys come up here I'm supposed to make it up here <laughs> the hell's taking you guys so long like automatic bro go outside They don't even know what's going on right now. Like, I hear them in there. But I don't think we can get them. Adorable, isn't it? Come on, little guy. You got the way. Oh, shit. What up, dude? What up, dude? What up, dude? Buy with your head. Dude, everything's XP in my butthole. Hey. Can we, uh... Oh, I should probably be able to fix those, huh? I don't know if I can. Fine. Oh, hello. You made it past the shotgun traps, did you? You little butthole. I need something from my other. I need something. Oh shit. Where is it? Oh, come on. Yeah. 
They don't even know what hit them, dude. There's, there's just. They're in love with me. And the heads go boom, boom, boom. Yeah, I forgot how fun this was actually. Fucking super robot base and shit. Super robot base coming at you. Oh, this bitch is out of ammo. I lasted the whole gun with the ammo. Didn't even have to fix it once. Shotgun traps doing the job of my Jesus laps. Oh, we got bird? What up, dog? On, shotgun traps keep on trucking just fucking keep on trucking dude so much death so many XP points the man <laughs> these shotgun traps are ridiculous Pairing. Turned it up to 64 de people, zombies. Look at all the bags of money. Holy loot bags, you don't know. Hey, 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 the loot bags. I guess that's it. You know. Sorry, the stream cut out halfway, or just right. What a what a showstopper that was. I bet. But uh, we got it all worked out, paused it up a little bit, and uh, that was super easy. Fucking elephant base. You crazy. I want to have your baby. You so crazy. I want to have your baby. 
So yeah, pretty fun. I hope you guys enjoyed the horde. Now let's go loot these motherfuckers. Let's go drop everything off in the old box and see what kind of goodies we got. Uh, everything but what we just picked up. So we're gonna drop that off, drop that off, drop that off. We're gonna have ourselves a blueberry pie because we finished fantastically. Didn't even throw one pipe bomb. Look, I got plenty of that shit. Oh, it just didn't want to load the new AP ammo. I had to hold it. My bad. Uh, we don't need those anymore. We can keep that. Um, and basically... Otter said, Four zombies. Oh, welcome, Otter. Poor zombies, I know. You should uh, join me on my pacifist sh uh, stream where I am not shooting or hurting anything with a face. It's rather difficult to do when everything in the game is out to kill you. But uh, I figure it's, it's a worthy nod to the AI development. Uh, I think that someday when they do take over... Someday when the, when the uh, AI takes over, they will recognize that I, that I played games that was meant to destroy them, and I would took it light. Uh, hopefully they don't watch these ones. Uh, Hobo Stew or Meat Stew adds HP to your gear. Oh, word. Junior Sim Racing said, there is zero way you're making it far in pacifist. There's zero way, right? So, I, I mean, I designed the base that... I mean, I didn't design it. I, I, I've reallocated a base that is a loop base. But then what? I gotta have a bike to get away. So you let them loop around for a while, I'm guessing. And then, towards the end of it, get on your bike. Right away. They come chasing after you, all in their high-speed zombie mode. And then, what happens? They get turned off, and you can go back and hide. And I think I can. I think I can outsmart the computer. Is all I'm saying, bro. I mean, I can't. I can't imagine it. It seems like impossible, and I understand. So here's all the stuff we won. What did we win today? Oh, we got a new book, Stealth. Use the cover of night. Excuse me. Lightning. Inflict more damage. Alright, we'll read it. I own this one, so we'll scrap it. We'll scrap it. These are all shotgun shells, if you ask me. Uh, sellable commodities and a lot of food. $1,400 cash. Bunch of butt wipe money. We got a treasure map. If you found this note, this may be your lucky day. It's my lucky day. I've been bitten by one of the creatures. Oh, my. And the fever has taken hold. Oh. The fever. I get it. Hey, yeah. Junior Sim Racing said, Anthra successful horde. Let's go slayer. Junior Sim Racing said, Treasure maps are always fun. Yeah, I just did one just a second ago. Like that was the one thing I, the one thing I did on day 35 was a treasure map. Ow. So now I know not to log out early. I think you have to wait till after 1 a.m. So you don't up re-up inside this area. Nobody wants that, dude. I mean, unless you want to just XP fucking Get nuts with it. What's up, Super Sledge? You keeping it real? Uh, so stuff that we can scrizz up. Stuff that goes into ores and minerals. More scrizz up. Scrizz up. Thought I heard someone scurrying around outside. Sorry, I had to take a little calm breather. Think about where I was. 
We could make all kinds of foods with this. Foods. Canned foods. So we shall put all the canned foods away. Uh, the sellable, sellable, sellable. Otter said, meditate. Meditation. A new game I'm playing is Sons of the Forest. Uh, Sundays of the Forest. So I do that live on Sunday. Just so you know. The scariest, most difficult game I've ever played. Can be seen Sundays. This is my brass one. For more bullets later, this must be my lead one. Okay, so since all these are dead, this is going to be essentially the place. There's my, my my building base, I guess, for the city base, which we need to figure that. I mean, that I have no idea about that. Yeah, Daisy. I should. I kind of steered away from it just due to its popularity. I'm kind of a contrarian in that way and a terrible human being in that way. So, you know, when I see something getting super popular, Sons of the Forest was the first time I played it day one. Any game, really. Maybe Frogger in like 1987. Uh, maybe I played that day one. But I don't even think that was a, th a thing. <laughs> Potter said, you can get cholera and heart attacks in that game. Yeah, so uh, speaking of which, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> Sons of the Forest is a lot like Green Hell. And I play Green Hell. I played it years ago. Um, but in Green Hell, you need to clean yourself in order to even eat. Otherwise, you get sick. There are certain aspects, like it's scum, but in the forest. And <clears throat> I'm thinking Sons of the Forest, or the Forest series, is like Green Hell, but with cannibals and weird, creepy monsters. And you don't get sick. So, yeah, hopefully, and, but it's brand new, so hopefully in eight days when they do the update, uh, they implement some some sort of things like that. But yeah. Thanks for the, uh, I'll, I will look into it. Thank you. Let's uh, tool up again. Let's bring some food with us. <gasps> Just so we can have some food. Medication. I really don't need a chainsaw ever. Unless I'm base building. So that can stay on the bike. Except I'm going to need space on the bike for sails. Because I'm just setting up the sails. And then we can go sell everything that we didn't need or use. Say putting these mods on things, you know. Said, if you need advice, let me know. The learning curve on that game is insane. It's not the easiest game to learn. Dude, I'll take all the advice ever. So if I start playing Day Z, just you know, keep track of what I'm doing. Then you'll know when I'm playing Daisy, you'll be like, oh shit, it's gonna hit the fan. Uh, that's all the copper I had, son. Bitchin'. Why do I keep steal taking these? What can I make with this stuff? Alright, all the military stuff that's on lockdown. I'm already wearing the boots, so. F you in the A. S U in the A, don't wear a C, and J all over your B's. Otter said, just know that dying is learning. 
because uh, in days uh, that's when uh, you die and you die. <laughs> Yo, I know. I play Rust. I know all about like building stuff and keeping your stuff, and then like you could like go to dinner in real life and then come back and your shit is gone. That's the tragedy behind that. That's why I started playing Warzone because Rust was it was too too much on the heart, you know? It was hurting my heart. <laughs> I put too much effort into something and it's just like see ya over. But I get it. It's kind of meant that way. All right, I'm gonna need the meds. I need all that. I have this SMG uses these weapons. Yeah, but also repair that. Repair that. Okay, let's go out with a, a new set of life, man. I can make tons Potter, of those repair kits. Daisy, Daisy is like that, but much more realism than Rust. Like yeah, well, well placed bullet can and will end everything. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Rust it was way more like a game. And a tragic game. If you're into, like, hate and hate speech... Then Rust is for you. It was hard for me to just blend in. <laughs> I would ruin the game, I thought, for other people because I wouldn't kill them. So it was bad. You gotta, you gotta kill everybody, you know. Said, I am toxic enough without rust. Yeah, right? Dude, it's, it's epic. It's, a, it's one of those things where you're just like, no, no, please, no, no. You catch yourself doing that. And I don't think anyone should put themselves into that kind of situation, to be honest. Have you tried the green hell? Yeah, yeah, I was just talking about that. I played green hell when it first kind of launched and then for a little while I didn't play it when it first launched I played it after a few months that it came out I hate Rust, but I love Daisy Green Hell is epic I'm liking Sons of the Forest just because I like the act of building and sitting smoking weed in real life and like looking at the sunset and doing puzzles like I said just puzzles the puzzles are the best part it's like Figure this out. <laughs> and you just try to figure it out. Let's drink some beer. Nice buzz. Feeling rowdy. Can't seem to get my thirst on, you know what I mean? Let's drink some coffee. <laughs> I think we need water. So let's go make some water been a minute I've just been drinking coffee and everything else is bad for you the game's like yo bro oh fuck and then Shane's like yo bro why don't you bring your fucking water bro see that was always an option right there you just jump out the back and you get home free <laughs> you know, I do it right in the game. <laughs> ah, shells, butt. You gotta be crazy. I mean, you'd think I'd be all on top of my ship, but I mean, it's been a week since I played this game. I probably got frustrated last time and left everything. 
shared yield four leaf clover, four leaf clover. Oh, thanks, man. Clover, four leaf clover. That's awfully nice of you. Alright, let's get this shit turned to water, huh? Sorry you missed the horde night, XOXO. Well, you just back up the video a little bit. You should be in good company. We gonna make some bullets. We'll have everything set, and uh, we'll go look for a place to live. The next iteration, if you will. Let's see. We need way more than that. Don't be so stingy, you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. And then we go in here and we go cement, son. Actually, you know what? Dude, we're so close to a 4x4. We need... The chassis. So close, brah. So close to a gyrocopter. We need the chassis. I mean, can we just build them already or what? There's no way, right? Or is there? No, it's locked up. And it's locked up. Sucker bleh. That could have been super cool though. Oh, I just don't know. So, can I log out now without it uh, upsetting the vibe of the game? Am I going to have to come back in? Dude, purple elephant. Everyone should praise the purple elephant for at least two minutes. Oh, look, it's got a, it's got a new bag. But I'm, you know, I'm sad to see the purple elephant go. Um, obviously it'll still be here in the map, sitting here, um, pooping in the land, in the lake. It's, you know, we wanted to, we didn't want to pile up its poop out here, so we just let it poop in the lake. And it just sits up here and does its beautiful justice, dropping presents. Where did that, where did it go? It was right here. We all saw that, right? There was a gift there. And I waited too long. But the purple elephant was just a fantastic accompaniment to this crazy game and made life simple all the way up to day 36. As you saw tonight, robots all day, which. If it were up to me, I say robots all day. Pick up. Oh, there's that sound again. And I do believe some people are just <laughs> bouncing into the server or something. I don't know. I don't know. Purple elephant all day. I really appreciate you guys for hanging out. This is a two stream day. The first half of the stream was just the preparation and then the stream cut out, which is awesome. And then I hold, held off, and uh, we started up the Horde Knight. Said, trying to appease the AI with the robots. You know, yeah, yeah. Valid point. So my pacifist zombie game. Would it would it be okay if I shot zombies as a pacifist using robots? That's not pacifism. What I have to do is I gotta let them run around in a loop until they naturally tie themselves out 
And then towards the end of Horde Night, I just got to get on a bike and ride away. If I can even get a bike. Because some of the things in this game, you have to kill zombies to achieve the accomplishment. So I'm not even sure. I mean, if I'm not killing zombies, I fail it, right? Immediately. So I walk up, hit it, and then walk away. Because there's nothing for me to do. So we'll see how that goes. So, you know, hopefully that will appease the AI when they take over and they look back on, on all this study of work and my body of work. All right, well, he created art. That's something. And he also Potter said made sure that we were safe. Philosophy thing, but I don't think people see companies like Lockheed Martin as pacifists when they make things of war. Oh, definitely not. No, no, no. They're definitely not a... Uh, a they can't run on pacifism. Uh, basic capitalism is... has no sympathy for you as a consumer. It can't. I had a retail store for seven years where I gave a shit. At least I thought I did. And I thought I could care. I thought that I could support the local artists. And yeah, if you have a poc a pocket full of money and it just keeps it just keeps coming in, you're good. You can keep philanthropizing is that a word? You can keep being a ph philanthropist in the best sense of the word where you're just enabling good people to do good work. Now if you want to make money, I don't care what you do. You have to support bad business practices and employ them in a good business way. Man, that sucks. It's very rare, if you will, to be in Santa Cruz, California, and you build a board with a one wheel in the middle, and everything just works out punky dory because you just fucking invented a wheel. Wow. Epic. That's very rare. It's lightning. General business, they don't care about you, they care about their bottom line. should be the last one it gets worse with corporations corporations have to care about their bottom line every quarter that's four times a year they have to increase their profits or you're fired you can't run this business hey why is you know stephanie not doing her job why is steve not doing his job they can't be there because they're not Firing 20% of the workforce in order to increase profits. And, uh, buying slave traded goods in order to, cre to increase profits. This is the, this is sucks. Hopefully in this modern change that we're in the middle of, we can take care of one another and start doing things ourselves. Yeah? That would be the best Potter. case scenario. Said, said. The timing of that music was perfect for this conversation. They're LMAO. Epic. Epic. Thanks, guys, for hanging with me. It's been a great pleasure to kill zombies uh, with you. I apologize to the AI. But I didn't make this game. Just making content. I hope you all enjoy the content. I hope you all enjoy art. Uh, go check out my latest and greatest and time-lapse video. It was fun to do. Um, and, yeah. We'll see you guys probably tomorrow. Maybe Warzone Wednesdays if I feel froggy or I might play Sons of the Forest. Pickle what do you guys think? Said, said, you. you guys can vote on it right now. Sons of the Forest tomorrow or Warzone tomorrow. Whatever you guys say, I'll do. Or more of this. You could say anything you want. And hi, Pickle Mush. Pickle Moosh! Potter, Potter said, Sons of the Warzone. Sons of the Warzone, <laughs> of the Warzone. nice. Warzone and he'll join y'all. 
Warzone. All right, that's two for Warzone-ish. I like it. Let's go for it. Warzone it is. Warzone Wednesdays tomorrow. Uh, you want to do it at this time, Pickle Mush? At exactly this time? Because it's 5.05 p.m. for me. I'll set up my stream schedule and let everyone know. Playing Warzone with Pickle Mush. Or if you'd like it in another hour, if you need to Pickle get your head straight. Said. Sounds good. Okay, sounds good. Cool. Well, we solved that crime. Boom! Boom, boom! Purple Elephant, we praise thee for yet another day of Am I facing the right way? Yet another day of facing the right way. We have, we have, we have done it. Me and this guy. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> I got a half-assed green screen behind me, and I, I, I'm not. A, and I'm not a weather girl. I'm sorry. I'm not a weather human. <laughs> to all my weather girls, peace out. Thank you all very much. We'll see you tomorrow. Said. Glow it up. Glow it up, dude. Blow it up. Skaboosh. Said. Sunshine, 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 sunshine.